All right, come on in, hit the like button, think about subscribing if you have not already. And if you're new here, welcome to the channel, but most importantly, welcome to the Viking family. So this is gonna be my personal opinion slash review for Guy Ritchie's The Covenant. Uh, came out, it's still in theaters as of right now, so obviously 2023. But here's the plot. U.S. Army Sergeant John Kenley and Afghan interpreter uh, Ashmed are ambushed. Ashmed goes to lengths to save Ken Lee's life when Ken Lee learns that Ahmed and his family were not given a safe passage to America as promised. He must reply, repay his debt by returning to the war zone to retrieve them before the Taliban hunts them down. Now here's the cast. Now, in my opinion, Guy Ritchie is one of the top tier directors of, of uh, you know, the modern times. Uh, this film has one of the best camera work, scores, soundtracks, such a great quality film. This had great action, but didn't fully rely on it to push it forward. In my opinion, the dramaticness did it instead. However, the two main leads is what really kept pushing the story forward the most. The strong chemistry between Jake Gyllenhaal and Dar Salaam, in my humble opinion, both easily stole the film with their back-to-back -back performances, and the writing of their characters was phenomenal. Here is my rating, I'll come back with my final thoughts. This was such a powerful film, never got bored once. Such great acting and writing, definitely award winning. Honestly, so much of the of this tugged to my heartstrings. I loved Sushu and uh, had fun with it, but uh, Guy Ritchie Covenant is easily the new film of the year, in my opinion. Hands down, without a, dis uh, without a dispute. Um, but let me know in the comments below if you agree, disagree with any of this. What did you think of the film? What do you think of the idea of the film? Um, so, I'm going to have something out, but it'll probably be Friday. Um, so, so, you know, or maybe even tomorrow, but it's probably Friday. Um, so, um, I highly recommend this film, though. I uh, had such a, such a great time with this. Easily, easily one of the best films I've seen in a while, especially best of the war films in modern times. Um... So, remember, I love you all. Please stay safe and skull.